Peace to the family. What's going on, folks? Really want to talk real quick about, um, if y'all can see this, hopefully get my camera situated right. Let me back it out. Back it up. The dog days. of summer. Now, we've all pretty much have heard about the dog days of summer before. Um, the, dog day, the dog days are in the month of July, August, September, October, November. So, and that's where they get the word Jason from, right? That's when you're going to see the dog days of summer because, you know, it's still, you know, the sun is on the decline. I want to show y'all this again. I always do this little thing, this little, but we know this is six. This is the um, summer solstice. We just left 722. Now, the dog days of summer start around um, in July, middle part of July when Leo comes in, when Leo comes into, into play. So we have um, the dog days of summer and you have to wonder why do they call it the dog days because the sun is up here. This is the sun over the, this, this taking this natural procession around the sun is doing that, but you have a you have another planet that's called a dog star called Sirius. Sirius is another planet. It's actually Sirius A and Sirius B. But um, you know you have and what it is they and that's called the dog star, the dog star because of um. The people who found it, who first known about this Sirius, was people from Mali, Africa. And they was called the Dogon. The Dogon, you see the dog in that? The Dogon tribe of Mali. And these people, these African people, this is a D. These African people, these people seen the Sirius star before the Americans and the technology that we had knew about it at all. So of course they named it after the Dogon people of Mali, the Dogon, Dogon, the Dogon people. So this is when the sun is very hot. It's very hot because it's the dog days of summer. And they call it dog days because of how hot it is. And you can even look, and when you look at Sirius Satellite Radio, look what they got. They got the dog star, and they're using Sirius. And a lot of people don't know, because Sirius Satellite Radio is a satellite, and they just taking the name, saying that they're putting something above the Earth. Just like the planet Sirius. But you see the Sirius within, and they have the dog with the star. That's where that comes from. Just want to know that. I wanted to let you all know that they got that from um, African tribe in Mali, Africa. So you're in the dog days of summer where it's really hot. And it's from that planet where the sun is closest to Sirius. And actually in Africa, the new year is actually... African New Year is June, um, July 22nd, when the sun is closer to Sirius. But just wanted to drop that information real quick, and we'll catch up some information on the next one. Yeah, but the Dog Star, the Dogon people, those that that was even taken from Sirius satellite radio. So we just wanted to drop that, and you know it's just important to know what's around you. Look at that, Sirius. Even when they say, um, are you serious? 
That word comes from that word too, serious, but they spelled it like this. But it's just a rendition of the word serious. You know, you see that? So a lot of things we say, we get it from a lot of planetary alignments like, yes, sir, even yes, sir, S-I-R. S-I-R is serious. Yes, sir. Even even yes. Now, let's look, look at this. Yes is a representation or it, it comes from the sun. Like, yes, because when you say yes is a universal body language. When you wave in, when you shake your head up and down, when you nod your head up and down, yes, that's what the sun does. The sun up and down, it comes up in the morning, down, up and down. So that's a representation of yes. And when you say sir, you're saying yes, serious. The sun and serious. Yes, that's from the that's from the sun. Year that comes from the sun. Yeah. Like, yeah, that also comes from year. Because the sun, uh, it tells the year. It, it rules the year that you're in. So I just hope this is not too complicated. hope you all can understand that. And I know you will. You know, a lot of um, intelligent, smart people look at this information and can grasp it. But I just wanted to bring that out in case you didn't know. If you don't know, like Biggie say, if you don't know, now you know. But um yeah, yeah, year, yes. That is that is by the sun. You know, the month is ruled by the moon. Right? When you talk about the month, because every the months are ruled by the moon. The moon. Oh sorry, sorry about how I spelled that. I'm just running out of room. But you see moon, you see moon and month. M-O-N, just like you see it in Monday. But people say many moons ago, uh, many is what they're saying is many months ago. So just wanted to break that information. And you all hope you all having a great summer. And it's good to let the sun really um, kiss on you and, you know, not wear your sunglasses so much because it's actually good to let the sun... Um, and what, I'm gonna do. A, I'm gonna do a video too, on how the sun and the different planets rule different parts of your body. Just real quick, the sun rules the eyes. That's why they say you know, don't, you know, you got sunglasses. Don't believe your your lying eyes. The sun, even in this scripture in the Bible, talks about that too. Saturn is another planet that rules a part of your body. It rules your your ears. Saturn rules your ears. That's why you. That's why they have. Saturn has the rings about around it, and a lot of people have earrings. So, just wanted to drop that information. You all having a great evening, getting a nice meal this evening, enjoying this sun, this serious sun. It is serious too, isn't it? It's hot out there, but yeah, it's just the dog days of summer. All right, family, you all be easy. We'll catch you on the next one. Peace.